Hey guys. No, that was too short. Hey guys. If you don't know, my name's Cashley. Welcome to my channel. Uh, just watch my new intro. It's pretty cute. Okay, so today we're obviously doing the lashes. Lashes, lashes, lashes. So, why am I stumbling over my words? I don't know. But anyways, all you would need if you're going to follow along with this video, because I'm about to help you, some tweezers. You probably even don't even need these. Some lash glue. I use this Eye Envy by Kiss. But, I don't know, I might try a different glue. I just think my eyes are really sensitive, and I just, they just sensitive. A mirror, maybe. Wait, no, you definitely need a mirror. You definitely need a mirror, I'm tripping. Because if you don't need a mirror, then you more advanced than me, and you shouldn't be watching this video. This ain't the one for you. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, subscribe to my channel. Please, uh, I'm revamping my channel. I got a new header, and I'm just doing new things, and I'm just trying to do new things okay so the these lashes are really really small i'm sorry i ordered them online and they came in this pack and they're really small and i ripped my other lashes so this is what we working with hmm. okay so i'm not gonna use no new i'm not gonna use any new lashes so you guys need to take the glue off of your old lashes because you can reuse lashes unless you just got money like that then hold on be back okay so i'm back i had to be a mom you know i don't know where i was but we're about to put glue on lashes I didn't mention this, but if you have shorter eyes, you're going to need to trim your lashes to fit your eye. My eyes are kind of long, so I never need to trim mine, but you might. Now, I don't have nails, so it's easier for me, kind of, uh, to just do it with my fingers. But that's why I said tweezers, you can hold it with the tweezers, probably like, at one end so either the inner corner probably the inner corner not the outer corner I'm trying to be quiet because my daughter sleep so if the mood changed you know why me being a little mamiana okay so I'm about to put this glue on the lash whoa I just squeeze some out and then like drag it along. The place I mostly, well, I just try to make it even, but I put it on the ends because the inner corners are like my trickiest part. They don't be trying to stick all the time. So I try to make sure I have enough glue on there. I hope you guys seen that because I wasn't paying attention to you guys. So let me hold this one. You guys, I'm filming on my phone, but I'm going to get a camera soon. So it's going to be really, it's really hard to see. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Whoa. And I know a lot of people use hair glue. I'm just, I have sensitive eyes and I just get scared that. My eyes are gonna fall out. Like, I'm already blind. I gotta concentrate. Okay. So, we're gonna let that sit for a little bit. Um, you don't have to let it sit. But I do like to get it a little tacky because if not, it'll be messy and like. I don't know this glue just rubs off easily but it might if you have on makeup it might mess up your makeup the another another trick is that if you 
have on makeup um like if you get some of the glue on your eye you can just draw eyeliner over it because who's gonna be able to tell nobody did i put on highlighter dang i didn't that's sad i'll be back i'm gonna let them dry a little bit more because i get scared but if you guys want to see this look this is really my everyday makeup look because it's just it's central it's i cannot talk it's simple it's neutral i like it you know it's not doing too much it looks natural um well natural to me you know natural is different to everybody oh wow i'm about to one second but like i was saying you guys want to see my everyday makeup look i don't know if i already wrote a, did a video on it but i can do another one because i hate not hate but dislike all my old videos like i just want to give you guys better quality better personality better me because i'm like a shy person and it honestly took me a while to open up on camera and like sometimes you can peek and see like my personality but I don't feel like I try to portray that. So, a lot of my new videos are going to be dope. I mean, I have a couple videos that I previously recorded of some things. So, those videos, it won't be the same, but I got a lot of, I got a lot of new things coming. And one of those things include, where's my mirror? One of those things include a camera, so... Your girl quality going up. Okay, so with this um, mirror, it's easier if you like hold it down here, basically right under and just look down. Because if you like looking into a mirror like this and like trying to put it straight on, you're looking directly. And if you put, I normally don't put mascara on before, but it does look better. So if you do put mascara on it's it's gonna be hard to like go from this angle and put the lash on like this versus you just looking down and putting the lash on like this so let's let's do it Ow. Ooh, okay so i go above my eyelashes and Ah, close to the lash line. It's really hard because when you put mascara on, your lashes are like sticking up. Another thing you would need for this video is mascara if you want to make it blend, but a lot of people don't like putting mascara on their lashes because they don't last as long when you do that. So then I like to, uh, well, what I'm doing right now is just pinching them and placing. But I like to look up because when you look up, that's when you can see if there are gaps. You can see if there are gaps in your lashes and you can like squeeze, squeeze it together. So like basically shift it before the glue fully dries. And this inner corner is going to bother me. But <laughs> I can't tell if you guys can see. But yes, yeah, so no lash, lash. I have very small lashes. So even these small lashes show a little bit. But, um, okay, moving on to the next one. This one's a bit wet because I just had to redo the glue. I need to dip some in the inner corner. It's like lint on these freaking lashes. Okay, so looking down, placing right above, right above the lashes onto the lash line and then just pull and adjust you want to be like 
over here but not all the way at the end because you don't want the lash to be too wide especially if you have big lashes I hope you guys can see and then I'm just adjusting and connecting all parts squeezing together looking up making sure there's no gap and voila we got lashes baby but um yeah obviously these obviously these lashes aren't dramatic and i'm sorry because doing the last video i should have had dramatic lashes i know don't bash me for that but whatever you guys do want to see if you guys want to um i don't know what you guys want to see makeup videos i do makeup videos lifestyle videos mommy videos and vlogs so whatever you guys want to see let me know in the comments down below make sure you subscribe to my channel because we do have a lot of new things in store and i don't know i just like to know when people subscribe to me early because it just matters that you're here from the beginning like I don't know but anyways thanks for watching this video stay tuned bye I'm so cringy I don't know why I don't like leaving the camera I just have a hard time with goodbyes like even in person but I'm gonna leave now